this little Gila woodpecker hit a window and I, he's still alive, he's still moving. I can hear a crow out there. I'm not gonna let that happen. But, uh, oh, he's starting to move. Maybe he can get up and go. Back out just a little. Sorry about the reflection in the window. There's, there's a crow. Okay, the crow just saw me move. And now he's sitting on the fence over there. There he goes. Let's see if this little guy can recover. Give him a few more minutes here and hopefully he can uh, get up and go. Hopefully he just knocked himself a little silly. Not 100% that he will recover, but let's hope so. Trying to get on his feet. Sorry. I just don't know how badly he's hurt. But he's alive. And we can uh, always hope. Let's watch him for another minute and see if he can get up. Come on, see if you can get up, buddy. Come on. There's a better picture. He's noticing shadows of other birds going over. Oh, he's trying. There he goes, folks. While he's on his feet, that's good. Let's see if he can fly off. Just depends on how he hit and what's injured. We had a dove that hit a window and the rescue people took it in and found out all of its breast bones had been shattered and it would never fly again, so they euthanized it. I'm hoping this guy can recover. He's back on his uh, feet. And the neck is obviously not broken. I just don't know if he's broken breast bones or not. All right, I'm going to kind of keep an eye on him and I'll show you or let you know what happens. Okay guys, this is a good news story. That little female Gila woodpecker, she got up on her feet and moved into some shade and she sat there for another, oh, I don't know, four or five minutes, maybe more. And she flew over to this tree right out here and I saw her hanging onto the side of one of the branches. So she recovered and made it off into a tree. I don't know what'll happen after that, but hopefully she'll be okay. Thanks for watching.